Let's get started creating a simple website in Visual Studio's code. You'll have one of two screens open. It's very important that you open your root folder using the open folder option, either here in the start menu under start, you'll see open folder, you'll click on that and then you'll select the folder you want to open or when you open your screen you'll see an option that says no folder open you have not yet opened a folder and remember you want to open your root folder we will be creating a subfolder inside our root folder for the site I'm going to click open folder and I'm selecting my demo 2020 folder that's going to be my root folder for this project okay my welcome screen I can close now you can still work without opening a folder, but it's a bad idea. You're not taking advantage of all the features of Visual Studio's code, and it makes it easier to make a mistake in file management. Open your root folder in Visual Studio's code. Mine is my demo 2020. Now, I'm going to create my site folder within my root folder first with nothing selected. I'm going to click the second icon to the right of the name of my root folder and its new folder. I'm going to name my folder website one and I'm going to click enter. Now I have my website one selected as is the best practice. I'm going to go ahead and create my images folder and my CSS folder. So if I didn't have my website subfolder selected I wouldn't be creating this folder inside so and I want it definitely inside that folder so I'm going to create a new folder I'm going to name that folder images and I'm going to click enter now if I created my second new folder right now it would end up inside the images folder I can see images is underlined so I know this is the folder that's selected but I want it to be at the same level as my images folder so I'm going to click on website one takes the focus off the images folder and now I'm going to click the second icon again and I'm going to create my CSS folder then I'm going to click enter and now I can see that I have two folders inside my website folder if I have any question if I put them in the right place I can just close that folder if they disappear they're where you want them to be now I've got a few pictures that I've already gotten ready I'm going to put them inside my image folder by dragging and dropping and I can see they're going inside the image folder because they're indented so I know they're inside and again if I have any question I can just close the folder if they disappear I know they're in the right place so now I have my website one inside it I have my CSS folder and my images folder and now I'm going to create my home page best practice always named index.html but if I created it right now it would not be inside the website one folder where I want it so I'm gonna make sure the website one folder is selected then I'm going to click the first icon which is new file I can see that it's correct because I can see it's in line with my CSS and images folder not inside either one or outside of the website one folder I'm gonna name it index dot HTML and then I'm going to hit enter and I can see I've created according to best practice my website subfolder my CSS folder my images folder and my index.html page